Hi, my name is Oliver Thomas and I'm a BIM specialist here at BIG. And today we are going to look at how we are using Rhino Inside to streamline our workflows from design into production. As a BIM specialist, I have a unique position where I'm working with multiple teams on multiple projects. I'm responsible for the implementation of BIM and computational workflows, as well as standards and training within the office. I'm also responsible for testing and implementing new technologies and workflows that help enhance the unique design process that we have here at BIG. Um, which is where we came across Rhino Insight. And shortly after testing it, we immediately started to integrate it into project workflows to help that transition from Rhino into Revit. So in this class, we're going to look at some of the methods that we're using to streamline the transition from design into production. We have a clear design space in Rhino and a documentation space in Revit. So as a result, interoperability has been a big challenge in how we can streamline our own design process. And so during this course, I'll be taking you through the basics of Rhino Inside, and we'll be reconstructing one of our projects as a case study. At the end of this course, you should have a better understanding of Rhino Inside, its interface, the components, and some of the workflows which will hopefully help streamline your own workflows to enable you as architects to spend less time producing and more time designing. So go ahead, hit the enroll button and let's get started.